So what happens when an old flame and a current flame are thrown together trying to win the love of the same woman? I've been asked to interview for the executive chef position at the Chateau Frontenac in Quebec City. Quebec City, Canada? Yeah. Well, further north. I love how he points up. Yeah. Quebec becomes the beautiful backdrop of a culture clash and a love triangle in the new film French Girl. French-Canadian actor Evelyn Brochure plays the title character alongside, you see him there, Zach Braff and Miss Vanessa Hutchins. They are competing for her affection. Evelyn is joining us in studio this morning. And you were telling me Quebec City actually is your hometown. Yeah, and I just visited my mammy there a month ago. And, and when I was a kid, the Chateau Frontenac is heavily featured in the movie, as yes. you were telling me. When I was a kid and we would go for Easter to see my grandma, after seeing the museum and doing the, you know, the, taking in the sights, we would go to the Chateau Frontenac so I could pretend I was a princess and live there. So for me, it was such a full circle to, you know, go back to the chateau, spend a week there, shoot there. It was, it was really magical. Oh, good memories. Yeah. Uh, set this up first because your character is the linchpin in this tri in this love triangle. Mm -hmm. She, I mean, she's in, she's madly in love with Gordon, played mm -hmm. by Zach Braff. They live together in Brooklyn, and she gets invited to. Um, to run for executive chef position at a restaurant. Mm -hmm. and But what she doesn't tell her boyfriend is that the person who invited her to run for that job is Ruby Collins, her ex. So they're gonna meet the family. There's gonna be a, a bit of a meet the parents um, thing going yeah. on there. <laughs> That's pretty hilarious. And then, uh, but it's a, it's a rom-com. It's gonna stay you know, warm and tender and, and fuzzy and funny, but with a, with a, with a modern twist and with a bite, I think. Oh, and well, I love this the scene where he's trying to win over this this French Canadian family, yeah. and you know, and he's he's American, and he doesn't even know when he's stepping oh, in. Oh man, they're trying to <laughs> talk to him about hockey, and he starts talking about <laughs> figure skating. <laughs> but we can all identify; we're yeah. all a Gordon. We all try too hard when we want to be loved. That's so right. I think that you can we can all connect with him. I really love how you frame that. We all do try too hard. When yeah. we connect. <laughs> um, you play a chef. You get this job, of course, in the in the kitchens there. I love that restaurant. First of all, it mm. is. It's beautiful to look at. Mm. It is even better to eat. Um, did you have to do any special training to oh my get God, comfortable, or are you already a cook? I'm I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm an at home cook. I make I make family dinners for my family, so I'm not at that level. Okay. So I really did have to take classes. But the funny thing is that lady, that wonderful lady that taught me all the tricks, she was like teaching me to like squish the like garlic and like throw in salt. And but she wasn't there when I shot all the like cooking oh. scenes. And there was like 20 minutes 20 minutes left to the day, and they're like. Slap the meat, cut it, and like I was just like, <laughs> and like some bit. If you watch the trailer, it's it sort of shows that I'm not actually. A chef. Oh, I'm just looking at the views from this hotel. It's it so, so pretty, so pretty, it's so it's pretty, so beautiful. We've seen New York and we've seen you know Paris, but we haven't seen Quebec City, and and and, and it's so picturesque, and I think it's the perfect setting for a. And you know what I like about it better even than the city of Toronto, because the city of Toronto plays other cities all the time, but it's true. Quebec City can only play Quebec City. That's true. It's a signature city. It really is. Uh, the director. <laughs> have said this is a love letter directly yeah. to the province of Quebec. Mm -hmm. uh, I was just in Quebec on a family trip. Mm -hmm. uh, it is beautiful. Were you able to give your co-stars a bit of the flavor, a bit of a tour? Were there places that you took them? Oh my god, yes. I feel like it was such a family feeling. James and Nick have that way of creating a... It's like, it's not work, it's a celebration mm -hmm. of togetherness. Every day is so special and we, and they are, they are Party boys. So we, we went to a lot of. There were a lot of nights to remember. I a remember lot of one. Nights to remember. <laughs> yeah, story. one at Vin Papillon in Montreal. One at the Frontenac where we shot all night and we were drink, drinking mimosas in the morning. It was the day of the last shoot and it was just yeah. Even the behind the scenes sounds like a romantic, beautiful <laughs> film. Exactly. I wish I'd been there. Um, there are some very funny scenes here between you and Zach Braff, and of course in between Vanessa. Mm -hmm. Out of the three of you, who would be the first to break character in that setup? Wow, I think. Uh, who's the? Cl are you saying who? Who was the first? To, who, who would we'll laugh the most? That's oh right. my who god! Who would just crack while you were we just? These we things. were all cracking. Uh, Zach is a hilarious genius, and he would improv, and every take was different. And oh. James and Nick like to change the lines as we go along. So say it this way, say it that way. And Zach just really went with it. Oh. And he would, I don't know how they edited this movie. There was like 18 different <laughs> takes for every. And so we were just, yeah, just laughing the whole way through. I'm such a fan of him uh, on yeah. screen. So I'm really Me happy too. to know that 
it translates off screen yeah, as well. Yeah, he's he's a he's a genius. He's also he's also has a heart, and I think that's why we are so um, in love with Gordon because those those qualities that he has really shine through in his character. I'm so excited to see this film. French Girl is in select theaters. It will start on March 15th. So glad that you stopped by in studio. Enjoyed our conversation. Thanks for having me. It was really nice. All right. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked this, be sure to subscribe here, or you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.